Hello everyone and welcome back to another Jim Big Richard Crispy video. Today we have another brand new knife from SRM called the Cub. Now before we start, as always, if you haven't already, go and leave a like on this video if you want to see more videos like this from us in the future and share this video with your friends and family. Also, if you find yourself frequently coming back to the channel or would like to receive notifications when new videos drop, why not consider subscribing to the channel? With that aside, let's go and get straight into today's review. This is the box the SRM Cub comes in. We have a nice blue box, the SR name and logo in white, and the slogan on the front, along with some information on the back. Inside of the box, we have a black and white SRM carrying pouch, so you can carry a knife in here in case you don't want to carry it bare in your side of your pocket. And here we have the SRM Cub knife itself. Let's go and open it up. Now that is a cool looking knife. I'd get me one of these. There is currently two different variants of the SRM Cub. Both variants will be available on our website as this video is released. The handle of this knife is made from black G10 and has a small lanyard hole on the bottom. The handle of this knife is quite decently sized, so you don't have to worry about not getting a good grip on the knife's handle. On the back of the handle, there is a stainless pocket clip, so you can wear the knife in your pocket or on your jeans, shorts, or belt. The pocket clip is reversible, so in case if you want to wear it on the left side because you are left-handed, you can switch it to the other side for your comfort. If you look closely at the top of the handle, you can see that this knife has a crossbar lock. So you close the knife by pushing the crossbar lock down, disengaging the lock, allowing you to push the blade back inside of the handle. Moving on to the blade of the knife, the blade is made from 154cm steel and has a sheep's foot style to it. There's also no thumb studs on the blade, however there's a large thumb tab, so you, thumb slot, so you can put your thumb to the blade and open it with one hand. There's also a very decent amount of jimping on the top of the blade as well. The blade has a bead blasted finish to it with a flat grind. Lastly, let's go over the links and specifications of the SRM Cub. The black G10 handle is 4.22 inches long. The 154cm steel blade is 2.87 inches long. And the overall length of the SRM Cub is 7.09 inches long. And that is about it for today's review. Like I said at the beginning of the video, there is currently two different variants of the SRM Cub available. Both variants will be available on our website as this video is released, so go ahead and make sure to check them out after you're done watching the video. If you all have enjoyed today's review, please consider leaving a like on the video if you want to see more videos like this from us in the future, and share this video with your friends and family. Also, if you want to receive notifications for when new videos drop or posts drop on our channel, why not consider subscribing to our channel? Thank you all for watching the video. It means the world to us that you watch these videos. And I hope all of you have a great rest of your day.